Hey friends, it's time for reading program. Our volunteers are here and I have your work. Hi. Monday and Tuesday we introduce these new books to you. Your job today is to practice reading them. There are markers on the tables for you to color them in. Practice reading it again. Put it away. And then what do you do when you're done? The reading program starts late October. Before that time, we do do pre-assessments on all the children. We do letter sound ID. If they're beyond that, we might do a um, fry word assessment. It's um, the most frequently seen sight words, and so we will see what words they know. And then for the children who are even beyond that, we have a reading screen that the entire school uses um, for our report cards that we can do to see exactly what level each child is reading on. Before it starts, we have a uh, parent information night where, so the kindergarten teachers here at this school, we come back at night and all the parents come in. We tell them why we have this program, which is to get your kids reading, basically, <laughs> or to get them as far along with reading or pre-reading skills as we can. We give them hints of you know, for example, when you come in the room to be a volunteer, don't ask a child if they would like to read with you because if they don't want to, they will say no. So it's not really a choice. It's like, come on, you're going to come read with me. We show them how the book system works, how you sign it out, find a comfortable spot, and go through the process of reading. And then they just go through. You know, you, we need about three parents, um, three to four parents, every reading program. So it is very volunteer intensive. It, yeah. If it wasn't for the volunteers, we could not do this. Right. So this reading program naturally differentiates itself. They are able to, within their readiness level, choose books that they're interested in. So we have the interest level there. They're also able to move at their ability. Like some children move faster than others and if a children is reading at a first grade level, when they come into kindergarten, they're going to read at a first grade level and move on from there. If a child is still working on beginning sounds and letters, then that is the books that they will be in. Goes to sleep. Good job, Jackson. Another piece that we've added to this program is, um, depending on where the child is, as part of the reading program, they either have, it's like alphabet flip cards, where they have to name the letter, give the sound, and a sight wo uh, word that begins with that letter. But then we also introduce the fry words. So after the children read the books, they have these little index cards with fry words, and they flip through them. And they move up the list. By the end of kindergarten, we want children to be able to recognize the first 20 fry words. So it's differentiated by readiness. It's differentiated by choice, the In titles, the fiction, nonfiction. Yeah. Um, and then a separate part of it is while they're waiting to be read to, their work is also differentiated. So it's literacy time for all of us. And so children who are waiting to be read to are working on literacy skills that they need. Very hard today. Many children are not going to read in kindergarten, or, or some are not. Uh, the point is that you're very good about saying to these parents, you know, this is not about getting that kid to read right. because not everybody's going to be developmentally ready but they are going to be moving along and that's the readiness part right. that's the part I love they absolutely move along some are reading there is no question and then with today's curriculum and today's standards right the expectations have changed you are a rock star that was awesome Abby I think we're going to move you up to the next level of books what do you think about that? All right. A couple of the kids in your room, uh, I mean, you, you are saying that to me. They are already reading. They are. I mean, so you've taken them from where they were. They were ready. They're moving. And now they are like, I don't, they're practically reading chapter. I mean, they are on their way. Mm -hmm. And they're doing their reading. And the others are doing theirs. So it's mm -hmm. very, I think it's really differentiated that way.